All right, home builder sentiment dropped to a 10 month low this morning, but a slew of initiations from the desk of Wells Fargo grabbing our attention this morning. The bank naming DR Horton as a top pick, saying it is best positioned to weather the near, uh, uh, the near term rate storm. But with mortgages at a 23 year high in yield and rate, buyers could be under some more pressure. Joining us now, CNBC's Diana Olick to sort all that out. Hi, Diana. Hey, Mike. Yeah, I mean, look, DR Horton is the largest home builder in the U.S., and so they are essentially a manufacturer, and they're going to have to push product, and whether that means mortgage rate buy-downs as incentives or lowering prices, that's what they're going to do. And, you know, it's interesting because in the Builder Sentiment report today, they did note that builders are using more incentives. And I was talking to uh, housing analyst Ivy Zellman yesterday, and she said 70-plus percent of those incentives are mortgage rate buy-downs because rates are at such a high level now. It's sort of amazing, Diana. Everything happening in housing, uh, and then the bull case is pretty is pretty clear. Works to the benefit of new home builders as opposed to existing homes. I just wonder how much longer, you know, that can uh, that can essentially go in this time of scarcity. Well, look, we have a, a massive shortage of homes for sale in general, and so the builders really need to step up. They have a long runway. The question is, if affordability is hit this hard and the builders can't get the buyers in the door, we saw buyer traffic incredibly low. I mean, on the builder sentiment index, 50, anything below is... Uh, considered negative and the buyer traffic was in the 20 range so that's not good going forward but you know we just simply need more supply but again if the affordability isn't there you're going to see more people stay renters longer and right now rents are coming down so that's a little bit of a, of a bright spot in the market but again you know we need more people to sell their homes to get the existing home inventory up but why would you do that if you have a three percent rate on your 30-year fix and you're trading up to eight yeah it's a, it's a log jam for sure, Diana. Thanks so much.